What's up, Loop Troop? Loopy Fizz here, and today I want to go over these decks that I made and we showcased on stream today. Um, I actually really am enjoying the buff that they gave to Living Tribunal. It's great for the decks that I um, like. One of the decks that I ran way back when Modoc came out was actually my ongoing regurgitation deck. Um, I coined that name because I originally played this deck with nothing but like ongoing cards that get just regurgitated out onto the field. Um, cards like, man, we had Onslaught, we had <laughs> Omega Red, and um, Iron Man, Mor Morbius, Mystique, all these big cards that can get huge, right? Even Strong Guy, and I really enjoyed that deck, so... I, when I saw Living Tribunal, I was like, he's gonna be perfect in my in my deck. Cause sometimes you just get a clogged up a clogged up lane that you're like just slamming that lane with power, right? But the other lanes are kind of weak because you don't know where these cards are gonna go. But with Living Tribunal, he allows you to spread all that power, baby. So it just works out in your favor. So this first deck that we got, obviously you're gonna be running the Invisible Woman, Modok and hella that's the way that's where the um ongoing regurgitation comes that's where the re regurgitation comes from now this first deck is actually gonna be called <laughs> i try so hard in honor of Tri living tribunal i'm happy they gave him a buff but you got some big cards in here and giganto and infinite so if you get those out that's just that's just great right that's a lot of power spread around but you also got onslaught you got iron man you got iron lad it's a lot of stuff going on. Magic, of course, helps because the more cards you get and you can discard, the more power you're gonna be able to get on the field on that last turn. Taskmaster's in there because sometimes you have to make a audible play and go for a Giganto on the left or maybe an Infinite on the right somewhere and then Taskmaster it to try to win those lanes that way. But besides that, man, this deck has been great. You do get a little bit of more playing power with Jubilee and Iron Lasso. Sometimes when you don't get the cards that you need, you can still try to snag them from inside of your deck. Um, and especially when you have Iron Lad uh, last and you can play Jubilee and Iron Lad um, kind of like behind the Iron, I mean the um, the Invisible Woman. That way you know that you're going to hit, you know, Modoc or at least something, right? But you gotta make sure that you at least have that Invisible Woman down so you can get the Modoc down and then the Hella. Because if you discard your Hella, you cannot do this, this trick. And it's a really fun deck. We had a lot of fun on stream. I hope you guys can check this one out. But we also have a second deck we're going to be showing as well later in the video. And this deck is actually just a reimagining of my ongoing regurgitation from months back. Um, this deck has Morbius in it, which is great with discard because all those cards you discard are going to be buffing up Morbius. Even if he gets discarded and regurgitated out, he's going to cost another two points on top of him for himself it's kind of crazy um same concept with this invisible woman modok hella that's the, you have to try to go for that we have iron lad in this one we do not have um jubilee because we just needed an extra slot um we have america chavez instead to help us get those cards because we're not going to be running the um the jubilee you can probably go for the jubilee instead of the america chavez to try to make this a little bit more consistent is your choice really but I played it like this and I just kept it like this. Um, of course, Living Tribunal is in there so we can spread out that power, baby. I was so happy when they gave him the buff. I was so happy when this card came out too. Um, Iron Man, Onslaught. Of course, we're gonna have Strong Guy in here as well. A lot of people are wondering, yo, I've never played with Strong Guy. Where do I do? Where, what deck am I gonna put him in? Put him in a discard deck because if you use Modok on the last turn and you discard everything out of your hand, that's how you're gonna get that buff with him. And a lot of people don't use him, but I love Strong Guy. I love, you rarely see Strong Guy, but I love the fact that he's in his deck. I love off meta stuff. Let's make Strong Guy great again, right? <laughs> no, just, but no, I don't think he ever was really great, but he's great in this because you're gonna be getting a lot of power from him, especially if you get an Onslaught on top of him into an Iron Man. There's gonna be so much power. And we actually had a game today that had over 1300 power in each lane. Like it was, man, I'm, I enjoy the hell out of this deck. It's one of my favorite casual decks to play. You're just really trying to get a combo and work your work way around the puzzle to how you're gonna get it out. Things you do want to look out for is going to be obviously Enchantress, things like Polaris, Cosmo on top of your Invisible Woman. Of course, cool synergy with this one is that you do have Mystique, so you can Invisible Woman on one lane and then Mystique on another. So now you got two ways to, to drop down cards and it just works out so much better. If not, if you're not running with that, maybe you're in a Conquest and you don't they don't have those cards, then you can just Mystique your Morbius and you're just getting two Morbiuses. 
fantastic. I love this deck. I had so much fun. I hope you guys check it out too. Start playing off meta stuff. You don't have to play meta all the time, guys. Have fun with the game. Don't get bored of it. Check out this gameplay and I'll see you at the end of the video. Peace. Oh, thank God Gambit is gone. <laughs> thank God he's gone. Now, he can be brought back though. He can be brought back and that's, that's kind of scary. He can be brought back and that is kind of scary. I actually think I want to kill these cars over here. And I think I can do it if I, um, what you gonna get rid of? I knew he was gonna hit Jubilee. Something told me he would hit Jubilee. Like I just, I had a feeling, a strong feeling. I guess it could have been worse though. Now, if he brings back, if he brings back Gambit now, it's scary. If he brings back Gambit right now, it's pretty fucking scary. Okay, well he didn't, okay. Oh, I still don't know what his last card is, by the way. We don't care, man. He just got it. He's gonna have a 16 power Dracula if he gets it back, but he's not. We also get another card because of um, Jubilee coming back. If she comes back on a good spot. We're already winning though, right? So, oh shit. Giganto, he can only be on the left. <laughs> yo, I don't, yo, I don't mind. We're gonna, we're gonna work for the comeback guys. I'll eat it checkers. I ain't got no problem with it. You know, you come and go. Give me Modoc. That's okay too, I guess. I'm gonna play this on Fisk Tower. Just because I don't trust that he, um. Oh, I mean, I guess that's okay, man. Not, not yet. He might be about to end this. Not sure though. He might have something to turn off the lights. If he does, I'm not gonna snap because then he only loses a few cues from it. To me. He said, come on, Eileen. Moda! Yo, Fiona, thank you! Appreciate it. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, what do I want to do with this? Um, none of those cars really have to go into the same place. Yo, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome, Delight Dealing Near. <laughs> oh my god. There's a new update on Spotlight Caches? What? Yo, we don't care about that, Odin. I hope we don't. Do we care about that? We might care about that. 
Welcome, Yarfo. Yo, let me give you a shout out real quick, Fiona. As my opponent gets decimated in the background. Were you also playing? Oh, how's my stream going? My stream is going pretty well. I think we can win this. Maybe. No, okay, yes! <laughs> I got scared for a second. Thanks for the AQ, buddy. <laughs> la 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. How does that keep fucking happening? How does that keep fucking happening? That's two times in a fucking row, man. That's not cool, man. That is too, and the thing about it is that I was sniping it out with Iron Lad. Yeah, I made this up like, well, it didn't have Tribunal in it. I played with Tribunal in it last week. But I made this deck a long time ago. Back when Modoc first came out, I made it um Invisible Woman, Modoc, and everything. I added Tribunal to it like last week, but yeah. Interesting. Well, he, had, he he used the Shang Chi now, so. Jets. Tribunal Iron Man and Onslaught seems a powerful combo. If I got my hands in the I'll try it. It's a pretty good combo. I think I'm gonna lose this. How much power is this gonna end up being? Oh. He's going to um Valkyrie this. That's gonna be a big hit to my power. But we'll also be getting a big boost with these two cards. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to play out. We'll find out. Oh, he actually didn't do that. Would have been smarter to do it on the right, I think. That's how I feel, at least. There we go. So you see what I mean? Strong guy? Pretty good card. And honestly, he's nice because when you lay him down, you're probably not gonna have all your cards out of your hand. So you have to worry about Shang-Chi. I still don't know what you mean by stupid bus. Rip AAF. 
Wait, what happened? What, what did I, what did I, any, what? Immaculate vibes? Always. Nothing, nothing, nothing better. Always, always, always this, never the other. Oh no, no, no. Oh no, what is that? Oh, it's just that. I thought I had something I needed to be afraid of. Honestly, this is quite terrifying if I do say so myself. This man not only has Wolf, Bane, and Wong, he probably has Surfer, and he has some other shit too. I think he knows the Bane um, alien ant form. I guess something transpired involving a bus. Oh. Interestante. Do tell me more. Ay, que ramba! No, 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 papi chulo, esa es la that is spooky, scary, scary, scary stuff. Very, very, very spooky and scary stuff. Um, actually? Iron Man, this... Oh, shit, I can't do that, huh? I can do that, though. Think I should put them together? You know what? You're right. I should put them together. Actually, it'd be better if I did this right. This is probably better. somewhere else iron man damn yeah damn <laughs> that's definitely going in the video <laughs> that's a big ass morbius man it's Morbin time. <laughs> you ain't got much that can stop me. Ooh, goody, 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 goody. The gummiest of gumdrops. We're not gonna play over there. We're gonna play somewhere else. We want that. Now his his onslaught, I mean his uh, Noel could be quite dangerous. I have to see what this is gonna be. We already have the, the, the nuts. We already got the nuts. We're gonna play all our cards here. Invisible Woman, Hella, Modoc. Play Guile's theme? I don't even know if that's on Spotify, man. Dig the fuck in this weekend. Just got the Book of Doom omnibus in the mail Wednesday. I have no. Is that that shit from from Ben Ten? <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> I have no idea what that is. 
What is that? Got the Book of Doom Omnibus. What is that? Just a big ass book? Yo. If this guy was smart, he would set up Null into, um... Oh, does he not have Arnim Zola? Oh, he does not have the Zola. Damn. God I'm done. <laughs> he don't got the Arnim Zala. Ben 10 is the Omnitrix, if I remember. Oh yeah, I know, I know, I know. I was just messing, because you said Omnibus, it reminded me of Omnitrix and I was like, I don't know what that is, but I can say some some dumbass shit. Uh, why why not? Yo, I just need like we just need something to go on the left, something good. That ain't that ain't good. That's that's fantastic. I am Iron Man. Woo! Ah! <laughs> oh my god. It's beautiful. Yo, thanks for checking out the video today, guys. I really appreciate it. Like I said, if you want to drop a comment, maybe subscribe. I'm not going to stop you. We are, we just hit 300 subscribers on YouTube. Thank you so much. Blessings up. If you do want to subscribe, you can go ahead and click my face right here, or you can check out the next video right here. Peace out. Check you guys out later.